one. Well, figured might as well I do a uh, unboxing video. Got a new toy, so everybody does unboxing videos when they get new toys. So uh, I'm gonna flip my camera around and uh, let's get started. Okay, so I got a. I'll give me a show it over here. Uh, why does that say Denon? I didn't order a Denon. I ordered a Marantz. Huh. Now let's get this thing open and see if they actually sent me the right thing. Okay, in the box we got... Stuff. Looks like stuff. Got another box of stuff. And huh. well, I'm gonna pause this for a sec. So I got it out of the box. Did that way because it's a little hard to get to. But they did send me the correct thing. It says Morantz. Even though the box says Denon. For some wacky reason through the plastic yeah I know comment section worst unboxing ever because I literally have no idea what the hell I'm doing because I've never done an unboxing video <clears throat> so Here's what we got. A Marantz, I just shut off the TV, oops. AV7702.Mach2. Seven, seven, oh, it does Dolby Gamer Read Atmos, DTSX. Man, this camera sucks. Odyssey, HDMI, Creston, all the fancy shit. That you expect an AV receiver to do. The cool part is what's on the back. On the back we have all the connectors that you'd probably ever need. Got Bluetooth antenna, a Wi-Fi antenna for some reason, power outlet, duh. Yeah, not one, not two, not three, not four, not five, not six, but seven, actually there's another one on the front, HDMIs, three HDMI outs. So monitor one, obviously for the TV, monitor two, projector at some point. And you also have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Really? One, two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, thirteen point two surround sound. That's enough for full seven, seven point two point four. Or if you're a fancy bastard, you can use these guys, which are XLRs. Pretty fucking cool. This some kind of ground thingy. Got compound. Comp Component cables, or component inputs anyway, they're assignable components. Kind of useless considering that it's now illegal to make any high definition stuff with these because of because piracy. Got your extra zones, seven point channel in. If you spend big money on like a big Oppo BDP 105, something like that. Something for your Creston, IR flasher. This to control the external amplifier. Now what you'll notice is there's no connections for speakers. Now that's completely normal considering I have this guy. This is my five channel amplifier. That over there is my sub. That's one of my towers. What this does is I plug into here, into these guys, or these guys, but I don't really see the need. So I can get more stuff. So. Let's look at the accessory pack. 
I have a, this is enclosed, everything's passed. Basically this is a refurb because yes, I know I could have spent, yes, I basically know that the, I could have spent a little bit more money and get a new one, but I managed to get this for, let's see, $9.99 plus 65 bucks for a, for a three year warranty as opposed to spending like 1100 bucks and getting no warranty. You got your remote, a loopy antenna for some reason. This guy, which I think is for the auto setup. Uh, yeah, that's for the auto setup. This thing attached to it, another antenna for some reason. Beefy ass power cable. Antennas, also cool. Batteries, whatever. And a, what is this thing? Oh, there we go. Here's a logo. An Odyssey, can't even see that on the camera. An Odyssey, uh... oh, okay, this is for the, uh, the setup. Which you mean that this bag of cardboard shit is for, oh! That's to work with the, um, to set up your room. This is a, you see, this has been refurbished. This is everything that was checked. See, they check tuner operation, FM mode, check speakers, outputs, all analog outputs, all outputs supposedly checked. Be kind of pissed if it isn't. You also got a, we want to do the same kind of shit you get everything else. Read this before you go to the, go to the retailer. Call Morant's not them. Although this is a refurb, I'm not exactly sure how that works. Again, another, we love you, thank you for purchasing our shit. And... The standard warranty. Standard Morant's warranty. So, put all this shit back in the box. So what I'm gonna pretty much do is I'm gonna pretty much use all these guys. This is gonna be cool. So uh, yeah, first video is a uh, pretty much a shit storm. <laughs> but hey, I suck at making videos. As uh, probably this might be actually be worse than my popcorn video because I literally have no idea what the hell I'm talking about because I've actually never used this thing. I mean, right now I have this Pioneer in here, which I've had for years. But a lot of people are probably saying, "Well, if you already had one, why'd you buy another one and waste all your money?" Well, that has three HDMI ports. Three. Someone thought three HDMI ports would be enough. Yeah, let's see what kind of shit I have to plug in here. Cable box, Blu-ray player, PlayStation, PlayStation. So that's one, two, three, four, and a computer. <sighs> yeah, I have three HDMI ports. How do I get around it? These, switches, lazy. Also, there's no kind of good stuff. Oh, by the way, this is a uh, Vizio P-Series 55-inch TV. Really fucking good. Probably one of the best on the market. And then in there in my office is the computer that I hook up to the system. So, <clears throat> what does the front of this thing look like? Well, it's pretty standard fare. You have your volume, your input, and then a drop-down with... Hey, you guys can't see it because it's too dark. We got a screen, we got D-pad, some buttons, a USB, another HDMI, video input, setup mic, and headphone port. This, yeah, that's pretty much it. 